Hey guys, I want to show you a little tip that you can do in most 150s, 172s, 182s, quite a few of your small tricycle geared aircraft, and that is um, the last time I even had to add any nitrogen or air to this was 10 years ago. And I am not kidding about that. And the reason being is when it's setting in here in storage, I keep the weight off of it. And the way that I do is I hammer drilled in a um, little ring here into the concrete with a redhead anchor and then have a t tail tie down strap. When I'm done, I just grab this and pull it down and take the weight off of the nose wheel till it's off the ground. And what that's done, I think, is that it's allowed the strut to stay extended. And with it being extended, um, it doesn't slowly leak out. I think it actually maintains almost a perfect amount of pressure in there. I have not had to touch this thing. Um, about 10 years ago, I rebuilt it when it was setting out on the ramp, and I couldn't do that, and it was setting out there for a while when I was, um, um, before I got it into the hangar. Then the other thing I do is just after every flight, or before the next, is wipe this down. Just wipe it down. Prevent all that junk from getting jammed up there in the seals. Keep that strut clean. And I think that just does wonders. I really do. I just, I'm kind of meticulous on stuff like that. But anyway, just wanted to share that little tip. Real easy to do if you have concrete or something else. Is just strap it down and it keeps the weight off of that. Also, having that back there is really good when you're doing maintenance and you need to take the tire off or something like that. You're not having to put sandbags or some other kind of junk on the tail works out real well just like that so anyway that's it